Hey there, this is my new Juki DDL 9000C. I've been sewing on it for maybe five hours and just today I was noticing it sounds kind of dry. So I wanted to check how much oil was actually going to the hook. Um, in the manual, you'll see on page 24, it says how to confirm the amount of oil or the oil splashes around the hook. And they basically want you to get a piece of paper about that size Put it underneath the hook up against the machine, the back of the machine here, and to run it, it says to run it for five seconds. It doesn't say how many RPMs, but I found that if I'm not going fast enough, it doesn't show any splashes on the paper. So what you'll want to do is remove your, um, what is it called, your feed dog plate, your needle plate. Um, and your presser foot and your needle and you're going to want to put your paper just under here and you're definitely going to want to make sure your fingers don't get in the way of the hook. It says to keep it I think 5 to 10 millimeters below the hook so let me do that. I'm going to keep my eye under here to make sure I don't get close. some oil splashes um, it's not like a stream of splashes like this shows it's definitely more splashy but it's saying for the SMS version which I have they want 0.5 to 1 millimeter thick band of splashes I don't really know how to take this like is that too much or I'm not sure so this would be a large amount of oil if you have a 1 to 1.5 millimeter amount of splashes. So that looks like it might be too much. So I'm going to go ahead, get my screwdriver. And right here there's a screw. Right here it says counterclockwise you're going to do less amount of oil and clockwise you're doing more oil. So I'm going to turn it counterclockwise and then I'll turn the paper this way and test it again. Just make sure your fingers aren't in the way. the new splashes. I'm still going to loosen that screw. I tightened it um, clockwise a whole lot earlier because I wasn't seeing any oil. And I think I need to really loosen it. Okay. So let me kind of have this other piece that I use. I'll just Use this one. So, put it up under here again. Okay, so there's some more splashes. I'm going to do it one more time to loosen it, lessen the amount of oil. But I just wanted to share with you how you do it because the instructions can be kind of confusing. And I hope that helps.